Hey guys, how's it going? And welcome back to another episode. In today's episode, I'm taking you guys with me on a walk as we go to the store. And um, again, just thoughts on my brain and my mind, on my cere cerebral cortex. <laughs> um, I wrote a few notes down as to, I don't know, what I could be talking about and all that good stuff today. Um, you know, but the reality is, is that, you know, the real reason I'm making a video for today, for the channel, is because I haven't made, I noticed I haven't made a video in a long time for this channel. And um, it's, you know, I think it's been over, over a week, I don't know. Anyways, I was meaning to go live and I haven't been able to have the chance to go live. But anyways, the point is, is because I've been pretty busy. In fact, you know, the, the topic for today, I guess, you know what I mean, is do you have a plan? You know, I got a plan. You already know I got a plan. I've been putting that into motion. And that's why I've been so busy, busy doing, you know, implementing the plan and not having time, you know, for much of anything else, including making videos. So, um, even though I said I was going to be making more videos and other stuff like that, but, you know, again, priorities, you know, we got to get to priorities. So, you know, I guess, you know, today's video, what's it going to be about is, uh, it's going to be about that. You know what I mean? Like, uh, what are you doing? I mean, what are you, you know, what are you doing right now um, with your life, literally? <laughs> you know what I mean? Are you putting whatever plan into motion? You know, are you right now out there, you know, um, kicking ass and taking names? Or, okay, we got to go down this street. I'm taking a little bit of a different route this time. Um, but anyways, are you out there, you know, kicking ass and taking names? Or are you out there, you know what I mean, just moping about and, you know, woe is me and uh, getting life, having life running over you? so you know that's the thing you know that's what we're talking about you know we're going to be talking about today i'm going to just pretty much start laying out you know a lot of the things that i've been doing and talking about again things that are on my mind because you know the reality is is that look you know i know a lot of you guys are like hey why don't you make a video on the mask or why don't you make a video on the virus or why don't you make a video on hyperinflation or why don't you make a video on and the thing is, look, I've already made plenty of videos on that. And the reality is, is that, I mean, I'm not the, I'm not the kind of guy to be a, a beating a dead horse. You know what I mean? Like, there's enough people out there. In fact, there's tons of other YouTube channels talking about what's going on, you know? And, um, you know, and uh, dissecting it every which way. In fact, even some, uh, you know, YouTubers out there, man, it is very hot. I thought that the sun, I was going to get some more shade out here today. <laughs> but anyways, um... As I was saying, you know, uh, at the end of the day, even a lot of other YouTubers that I used to watch and respect and like and love, you know, it seems like they're just like now talking about, you know, they're going fringe on what they're talking about. And I'm like, you know, I don't want to be that. I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to do that. That's not what I do. You know what I mean? That's not what, that's not what I started this whole channel about or doing anything. In fact, when I was talking about a lot of the, I guess, conspiracies, you know, or, you know, basically when I was already kind of calling a lot of the things that are happening now, when I was calling that out years ago, um, you know, to me at that point, it was more like a cathartic thing. You know what I mean? I was a a as well finding these things out, not understanding why so many people out there just did not get it, did not want to get it. Um, you know, just so many other things like that and just making videos and racking my brain on it and all this other stuff. And then, you know, fast forward later to, you know, mid 2020, and we're in the middle of all these things, all these thoughts that I had in my head. Like, oh, damn, we're here in one shape, form, or another. And, um, you know, I tried to make some videos on it. I tried talking about it. But at the end of the day, it seemed like most people just really didn't, you know, everybody just picked their own path or decided to, you know, um, soak this in very differently from person to person. You know, some people started waking up. Some people started going further, deeper into the, into the, what is it? Not to the rabbit hole, you know, but yes, you know, a lot of people were going deeper into the rabbit hole. Some people were just starting to wake up. A lot of people started, uh, you know, getting more in denial, started, uh, you know what I mean? Doing the complete opposite, you know, meaning, well, you know, they're the ones that are out there, um, you know, um, still proposing that everybody has to wear like a triple mask and get you know a vaccine every month or whatever you know so and again there's nothing wrong with that you know for whoever you know for whoever's out there and is into that kind of thing go for it 
You know what I mean? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if, um, you know, real soon we all got to get those COVID, COVID passports and those special super duper, um, you know, whatever it is we got to get, man, you know? Um, and, you know, none of this is a surprise to me, you know what I mean? I look at a lot of history, I look at a lot of things from the past, and I look at, you know, what we used to be as people back in the day, not too long ago, 30 years ago, give or take, even further back, but this is something recent I was looking at, and I was just like, man, how far we've changed. How, how far we've come in those 30 years, um, how far, how much we've changed, you know, the public perception of so many things, just so many things in general, and, uh, it's pretty crazy because, you know, again, I, I see what's happening around us right now, and it's just something that's already been done and redone and redone, you know, so many times that they, they stop keeping track of it. And what do I mean by that? Well, you know, basically everything that's going on right now in one shape, form, or another, you know, we've dealt with in one shape, form, or another in the past already. And um, we don't have to go that far back as like, you know, a hundred years or thousands of years. No, 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 no. As far back as just a couple decades. And how, you know, basically there's always gonna be a humongous swath of the population that's always gonna be falling hook, line, and sinker for all this. And another large part of the population that's not gonna be falling hook, line, and sinker for, you know, whatever the hell's happening at that moment in time. And so in this case, you know, the people that are still falling hook, line, and sinker for this in one shape, form, or another, you, you see them all around you. You know, they're the, the zombies. You know, they're the, you know, the NPCs, right? The non-player characters. You know, they're all of these t things, these terms that we like to, you know, playfully call them. And so, you know, at a moment like this, it's really more like, you know, a lot of people are like, man, what is the place where I can go that's the safest and this and that? And you already know. You know, I'm in Mexico, I love it here, but I also got one foot out, you know what I mean? Like, you know, I got a lot of things planned, a lot of trips, you're gonna see, you're gonna be coming with me and stuff, but you know, at the end of the day, it's not even, it's not even about that, you know? It's just being, again, trying to be one, one step ahead of the game. As, again, as you guys see, you know, in this part of Mexico, there's a lot of people wearing masks and, you know, following the whole zombie thing. But in other parts, it's not so much. And it's not even about that. You know, the end of the day is like this, all around the world, outside of a few areas like that are you know like africa or you know just places you know like certain places around the world um i'm still you know on the fence with what's going on in india you know what i mean i'll believe it when i see it but that's another story for another day but you know at the end of the day you know with what's going on um you know all around the world now where there's so many people falling for this hook line and sinker it's your job all right let me see i'm gonna put the camera forward here so you can see, I got to cross this situation here. Let me see. Let me just go for it. This guy's like parked in the middle of the street there. So I don't know what the hell he's uh, he's doing. Anyways, all right, back to what I was saying. So, oh, oh, I just noticed he's uh, he's learning how to drive. I apologize. Anyways, um, okay. So, like I was saying, you know, what I mean, you're gonna find out tons of people all around the world that are falling for this, like you know, hook, line, and sinker. Um, and again, just like this, there's so many other, you know, things out there that are going to be in the same, you know, um, kind of realm. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to walk in and not get run over and not trip. Okay. Um, so for example, what do I mean? As the world is falling into chaos, you know what I mean? Meaning that everyone's, you know, wearing the mask, not wearing the mask. Some places are going into ultimate lockdown. You know, all of these horrible things are happening all over the place and some more than others. You know, what are you going to do? Are you going to be part of all that? Or are you going to, continue? you know, all of a sudden, like, uh, take it upon yourself to, again, I don't want to use this word, but this is the word, capitalize on the situation. Because right now, you, if you're part of the zombie apocalypse, you are being capitalized on. So if you don't want, if you don't want to get capitalized on, then you need to do the complete opposite, which would be, you got to capitalize on this situation and that's it. it's as simple as that and not feel bad about it you have no control over what the hell is happening and all you can do is make sure that you come out okay on the other end and um you know i'm gonna be doing more videos in the future 
talking about like nfts you know what is that you know it, it, just more education and more solutions i've already talked about gold and silver i've already talked about you know so many other things if you haven't listened by now i don't know what to tell you um and so many other ways to diversify yourself but now you know again just try to take it to the next level and learn how to not just um you know survive this but you know again you know thrive and so what are we going to do we're going to learn how to what is all this you know it doesn't mean that you're going to be out there making nfts or or things like that but if you learn you know what i'm saying um that gives you a major 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 head up on so many things in in life so why not take the opportunity to learn you know what i mean to learn how to you know not just make one of these things but also um what it is and how to do it and all this other stuff i looked into it already it's not that hard and so you know i got to do it for my purposes of you know what i do for a living and what christian does for a living you know um so it's a very important thing that um we both not just own that we both not just need to learn but also figure out how to how to you know what i mean like implement on a regular basis so anyways you know um i'm here at the mall we're almost there what i'm gonna do i'm sorry, i'm gonna turn the camera off here and we're gonna continue talking about the things in my mind as we walk home you know um i gotta go in there just buy a few things and uh, head back out and uh, i'll see you guys when i get out of here all right 20 minutes later all right guys so we're done with the shopping see so i got my my backpack full my little bag over here full i always overdo it that's <clears throat> always bring a backup bag so all right let's get uh back to the conversation so <laughs> um what were we talking about so yeah i mean look let's uh, just get back to the thoughts in my head so you know a lot of the what and one of the thoughts in my head at the moment is uh <clears throat> you know how busy i am but not as it pertains to like oh i'm so busy um you know I, I can't handle my life and there's too much going on no 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 i'm enjoying every second of it the busy part comes because a lot of you guys are always asking me you know what keeps me so busy or a lot of you guys are always like <clears throat> calling me last minute i never even heard of you i don't remember you guys watch my videos all the time you guys know me through my videos because you guys watch me all the time but a lot of you guys just hit me up out of nowhere i never even heard of you and just sent me an email hey uh we're in town you guys want to chill and i'm like well yeah that'd be great but you know i'm kind of busy <laughs> you know i have a life <laughs> you know i have like a million other things i gotta do plus as each day goes on and on you know there's more and more people moving out here there's more and more things to do out here um you know as things open up um but not just that but meaning you know as um as more and more people are coming out here and more and more things are opening up you know there's more uh you know activities for me and christian to do and i can't film everything in every aspect of my life and i don't want to that's not <laughs> what i'm doing this for um but you know what i mean like at the end of the day um I film parts of my life in which, you know, I can take you guys with me on a private little walk or, or bike or whatever. And um, a lot of times, you know, when I'm going from place from point A to point B, I'm busy. You know what I mean? Like I'm um, right now, I had to, hold on, good. I had to go get some groceries so I can make some dinner for me and the missus. Now, yeah, you know, we could order dinner. We could order out and do all that, but why would I, you know, I don't want to do that. I'm trying to remain healthy here. In fact, um, I start uh, training tomorrow um, to get, you know, my knees back in shape and just to get in better shape. And uh, so I'm already working on that. Finally found the gym. I don't have to wear a mask in. Got together with a friend of mine. I might be taking you with me in the future so you guys can see what's up. Um, but yeah, you know what I mean? Like at the end of the day, you know, right now, um, I I'm, me and Christian are basically book solid. You know, she's very busy you know doing her work her artwork because a lot of people are always asking like you know a lot of people a lot of you guys again and i get that you know it's not it's not it's nobody's fault there's no one's fault but there's a lot of misconceptions out there maybe that christian ain't busy you <laughs> know she ain't doing nothing. no man you know what i mean she's very busy um a lot of times busier than me um because she's always like uh going now she's like you know now as things are opening up again you know now she's taking workshops going to school not virtual like real ones you know so she's out there doing things and you've seen a few things whether it's the fresco thing or here let me show you a little bit of the last thing she was just doing this this past week here look check out christian what she's doing <laughs> how's it going 
bien, hay de todo. Hay sí, hay no. Pues es un experimento extraño. Ok, para ok. Incluso para mí, porque pues no estamos acostumbrados a que nos digan no. Y obviamente esta imagen es un poco. Yeah, so this is what she's doing. I'm going to explain to you guys in a minute what exactly what she's doing. No aplica porque no, yo le dije, no le dije nada. All right, so uh, flip it around. Show the people. Look at that. So she's bait here. I'll show you that, okay? All right. Say, eh, hey, smile. <laughs> well, how's it going? ¿Está viendo bien o no? Okay, okay. So, hey, ¿tú quieres tu teléfono? Eh, empecé como a repartirlas así, pero al momento que la gente veía que era una mujer desnuda, era así como que no. Oh, wow. Entonces, okay. ahora las estoy empezando a repartir así. Okay. Directamente con la oración. Y no, nice, nice. Lo vean, es... Entonces, son cosas. Es interesante porque uno va descubriendo, pues, cómo es el pensamiento de la gente. O sea, esas cosas están ocultas y no siempre se demuestra. Por ejemplo, si tú le haces un censo directo, una entrevista a alguien, eh, muchas veces puede modificar esa respuesta. Pero en cambio, cuando es una interacción como más directa y un poco más espontánea, las personas actúan conforme a su ideología y conforme a cómo piensan. Entonces, es más natural ver el, pues, el símbolo del rechazo y de lo que les desagrada o que va en contra de lo que creen. So, as you guys can see, you know, that's what she was just doing this last week on top of, um, you know, we had an event on Friday night um, in between all that, you know what I mean? Um, an art showing for her, um, you know, but just plus so many, many other, other things, you know what I mean? Um, that we have, that she has on her plate. And um, not just, you know, um, what, you, what you saw there this past week. But going forward, you know what I mean? There's just so many, many things, you know, um, she has to do and going to be doing. So with that being said, all right, hold on a second. I'm trying to, trying to get this all straight here. Um, you know, we're going to be going back to Oaxaca real soon. And the reason we're going to Oaxaca this time around is because uh, she has to, uh, she has to do some, another art project thingy over there. And um, I don't know how long it's going to be, at least a week, I think. And, um, you know, while she's busy doing her art stuff, I'm gonna have you know um, you to myself and we're gonna be exploring the city as much as we can and sometimes she'll join us sometimes she won't but it don't matter we know we're still gonna be there enjoying that because I love it here I love Merida but I also want to see what else is out there and um, as soon as we can as soon as uh, it's feasible we're gonna go to other countries and stuff like that but if you guys watch like any other you know like uh, you know travel youtubers or anything like that out there you know, for the most part, you'll see them, um, you know, they're just going to places like Mexico. They're going to places like, um, where are they now? I think like Africa, there's a lot of people in Africa. Hola. <laughs> uh, there's a lot of people in Africa and stuff like that. There's people all over the place at the moment. So that's the thing, you know what I mean? Like it's like, there's, but, but I mean, but it's not that many spots. You know what I mean? Africa is kind of like not a place that we can uh, travel to now at the moment for many reasons. You know, we got Gizmo, for example. That's just like one reason, one big reason. Um, but we can definitely travel to other parts, you know what I mean, that are a lot closer and all this other stuff. But regardless, man, that's not the point, you know what I mean? Um, you know, we want to just keep living our lives and doing our thing and, and all that jazz. So with that being said, you know, um, the adventure continues, you know what I mean? So, you know, like I'm just in the sense of like when people are, a lot of, a lot of you guys are always kind of like asking me, you know, what am I doing? It's like, well, not only am I just doing the regular do daily duties of life. You know what I mean? That everybody has. I'm not special. I don't got a maid, I don't got a chef, I don't got anything like that. I gotta do all that myself. Um, besides all of that, you know, um, we have to also, you know, do other things. Like, like every other night, you know, we're going out with uh, some of you guys, um, which have made plans accordingly, you know, ahead of time. Uh, <laughs> because uh, I don't wanna say take reservations, but I guess, you know, yeah, get reservations with us because, you know, we're just, very busy and again it's not just busy you know with uh going to dinner and meeting you guys but having meetups we've already had our first meetup out here we're working on meetup number two and we're gonna probably have one like every month month and a half or so because you know the the, the people out here keep growing what the community keeps growing um so many things um are growing in that sense so we're not stopping anytime soon we're gonna continue doing all that so you know we're doing that we're um, doing family stuff, doing our own regular, you know, stuff, you know what I mean, our life stuff. She's doing her art stuff. I gotta, remember, I gotta edit videos, I gotta do whatever. I do videos for the other channel as well. Um, I do all kinds of side work and side hustles. Look, in fact, before, 
I used to be more hired for work. You know, you guys used to, you know, hire me um, to help you with a bunch of things. But as time has gone on, I've been so busy and I've been, how do I say this? You know, doing so many other projects and, you know, in a sense, financially sound for many, many, many other reasons. I'm not, I don't have time for any of that anymore. You know, I'm so, I'm, I'm unfortunately, you know, but because of the Facebook groups, because of the networking, because of so many things that we've done and put together over here, you know, basically now we have a network, a whole system in which, you know, um, whatever you guys need, we can still get. In fact, it'd probably be working out better here because you don't got to pay me and sometimes you get it for free. Or, you know, again, you go to a trusted source because um, now that we have a little bit more of a network with all that, you know, it doesn't, you know, I, I know some of you guys would prefer me, but you know, hey, you know, if it's not me, it's someone that's uh, well trusted by me. And, uh, and that will have to do, you know, because like I said, I just don't have the time for all the things that I used to do all the time. And so it's not a bad thing, you know, I, we evolve, you know, we do bigger and better things now. Um, I do more things now that I enjoy. Um, every single day, you know, it's literally awesome and fun. Um, in fact, you know, that's why now I'm going to start doing more of the workout and more of uh, things like that because I want to be in better shape. I want to be able to do more. And, um, you know, again, you know, when I pick up the camera, you know, I want to be able to want to do this. And uh, so far, so good. You know, there was a time where, you know, I was loving what I did, but it got to be a grind and not fun anymore. But thank God that I made a lot of videos, you know, talking about a lot of the things that are going on now. And it's awesome every time, you know, every other day I get, you know, comments on my videos on this channel saying, oh my God, I just realized you said this three years ago. I thought you were saying this now. Holy shit. You know what I mean? Like, you, you know, you're on point and this and that. And so again, I, like I was saying earlier, I'm not here to be beating a dead horse. It is what it is. I'm very happy with the results of everything I've done and gonna be doing and, and all that good stuff. And uh, we, we have so much more, man. So much more fun, so much more adventure, so much more to show you than just the average bear. And um, like I said, you know, I'm gonna be working on a live stream real soon on how to make an NFT just to beginners, you know what I mean? Just to, you know, for just to, you know, again, I'm gonna be making a lot of things, but this is gonna be one of the things that I'm gonna be making and then some and so on all right there's a lot of noise coming from over there let me go inside i gotta get a grab a couple things and then we'll wrap it up on the way home eventually all right so we're done here um it's funny as i was just leaving i was about to start recording uh some guy on a motorcycle that was leaving as well from the store it was like 41 what 41 41 degrees i like, oh shit, yeah that's right so it's like 40 anything over 40 is like over 100 degrees fahrenheit um like 41 degrees celsius yeah that's how hot it is and humid but you know um it's kind of cloudy because of the humidity um i'm not sure if it's gonna rain it's only gonna make it hotter so i hope it doesn't rain but regardless um it makes it um it's today's a little le less hot i don't know i just feel it less hot than other days when uh, the sun is full blast and there's no clouds or anything like that so you know it's all good so all right speaking of which uh so yeah you know like i was saying you know we're gonna be wrapping this up now you know we still got a little bit before we get home but yeah, you know what I mean? Like, uh, just coming full circle to what I was saying at the beginning. Um, yeah, I'm, my plan is in, is in play. And my plan is, you know, changing all the time. Um, you know, we're now in a different state of events in the world. As much as I want to share every single thing about my plan and what I'm doing, I can't. And it's and if it's, you know, if it's not plainly obvious to every one of you as to why I can't, then... Uh, I don't know what to tell you you know i still love you guys no matter what but you know that's the reality of it so you know i'm still making content i'm still out there in fact you know you guys if you guys really miss this channel if you guys really miss the content on this channel you guys really miss everything on this channel i would highly 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 recommend and suggest that you guys check out the podcast the podcast is is demanding a lot of my attention at the moment because you know we're we're getting hundreds of views now per episode and we have you know two episodes every week on tuesdays and thursdays at 9 eastern okay and 9 eastern p.m 9 p.m eastern 
sorry, <laughs> at 9 p.m. Eastern on Tuesdays and Thursdays, we go live on YouTube. All the links are down below. We go live on YouTube and you can check us out live. Or, you know, later on, you know, um, at your convenience, you can download the podcast and listen to your leisure. You know what I mean? Um, because I upload that same night. As, as soon as we're done uh, with the podcast, I upload. I try to upload as quickly as possible. And, um, you know, the episodes are up there. So, if you really, really, really want to see and hear what's on my mind and the things that I, you know, what I'm really, really, really doing more than anything else, and I was on the podcast. So I will highly suggest you guys check out the podcast if you want to hear more of me on a regular basis because that's where I am. And I'm making content here, not as much, obviously. I'm going to be working on what kind of content I'm going to be making here. We've already been through it this whole year, trying all kinds of things, you know, hit or miss, you know, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, we're gonna still, you know, keep figuring it out. At the end of the day, I got the travel channel, which I post like around two to three times, well, like about three times a week on that channel. The podcast is two times a week. Um, and you know, just other stuff, you know what I mean? I don't have time for the cooking channel. I wanna do cooking. I really wanna get back to the, the cooking, but I just don't have time. I really don't have time. And so when a lot of you guys are asking me, hey, can we meet up? Hey, can we this? I don't have time <laughs> most of the time. I don't got time to do the things I wanna do, let alone meet a stranger I've never met in my life. You know, so it's like, and again, I want to meet all you guys. I really, really want to meet all you guys, but please understand, you know, <laughs> yeah. going back to priorities and all that shit. So, all right, guys, with that being said, I got to get out of here. We're almost home. I really appreciate you guys more than anything, more than you could ever imagine. So if you like this kind of content, you already know what to do. Don't forget to please like, please subscribe, please share, please hit that bell icon. But more importantly than anything else, please stay awesome. Thanks again for watching and uh, see you guys in the, on the flip side. Which I mean, that, that means on the next one. That means next episode. I don't know what channel. Probably the podcast. Check out the podcast. Wrapping it up now. Bye.